the worst radio moment of my life, and I had dozens, created mostly by myself, <laughs> was when the program director, Alan Emery, said to oh, me, do you remember Alan? Yeah. Oh. Said to me, there's a small circus in town. I said, we work here, buddy. <laughs> um, he said, no, it's out at Bayview, which was near where I live. And he said, there's one of those circuses in town, and they have a baby monkey, and we want to run a contest um, to name a monkey with the kids. So that's great. So we did that. And he said, it will culminate with the man coming in to the studio with the monkey. The kids will be there. And he said, and I've arranged for a magician to uh, be there. And I said, he said, you're going to broadcast all this. I said, how can you, Alan, how can you broadcast what a magician's doing? <laughs> well, he's pulled out of the three of hearts, obviously. And the man turned up with the monkey. And the monkey was in the talk studio next door on a perch and a chain. The kids are looking through the window. I'm trying to describe magic tricks on the radio. <laughs> It really works on radio. <laughs> and uh, then it came time to name the monkey. I went in to the studio with the man with the monkey, pulled the monkey up off the little perch with the chain, and the monkey had had a guts full of all this, the kids looking at and the monkey bit him <laughs> in that part of his hand, right there, and the blood spewed everywhere. He strangled the monkey. <laughs> in front of the school children. <laughs> the monkey shit itself. <laughs> and I'm broadcasting this. <laughs> I'm describing as delicately as I possibly can as to what was happening. Well, I fled into the, the, the studio and I forget what the name of the monkey was. It was probably called... <coughs> <laughs> Children were rushed out of the place. The cleaning lady resigned because she wasn't going to clean up the monkey shit that was in the studio. And the man who strangled the monkey was up on a murder charge three weeks later because he, he threw a tent peg up the door and hit the woman in the head down the Bayview domain. It was bloody hopeless. But anyway, it's been great being here and seeing so many faces and things. <laughs>